Alright, so I'll be doing the Diva versus number system. I didn't practice too, so it's about number system. Alright, so um, it requires me to work on binary numbers. So what are binary numbers? So I'll just remove this like that. Okay? So open up the piece of paper. Alright, so binary numbers are numbers represented by 1 and 0. What do I mean? I mean by this. Like 2 is 1, 0, 3 is 1, 1, 4 is 1, 0, 0, 5 is 1, 0, 1, and 6 is 1, 1, 0. And uh, of course, so on and so forth, right? Alright, so my first question would be, first question I get, a uh, whole one. So the first question I have is explain how I'll try to write as fast as I can would convert nine one from a decimal system to a binary system. Alright, so um this is what explain how I would convert my one from a decimal system to a binary system. So yeah. And this is how I gonna do it. I, I found this method online and um, I don't think it will work because I will show you first. First, you draw eight lines. Then add these numbers. Okay, how I get these numbers? From the word binary, right? Okay, you see the word binary? By is two. All right, so by is two, right? Everybody knows that. So this will be two to the power zero, two to the power one, two to the power three, so on and so forth. And then one to eight is two to the power seven. All right. So um, yeah. Don't really have to write this. Now, why I say that this cannot be used for all types of numbers because of twenty eight is like the biggest number that is twenty eight. But, and then, like, let's say they give you a number is 169. This number is so big, you need more lines. Yeah, so, uh, actually this method, you can use it, but you have to add more lines if you want. Uh, don't mind the trouble of adding more lines, but 8 lines is, like, just enough already. So, let's convert 9 one. Alright, so you cannot fit this into this because it's like, I got a 91 size box and a 28, 1 to 8 size box. How to fit in, huh? Because this is so big, am I right? So you can't fit in. That's, that's what I mean. Okay? So, um, yeah. So if it can't fit, then you put a 0. If it can fit, put a 1 like that. So then, after it, there's a 1, right? So you minus. You'll get 27. No. Yes. Yeah, you will get 27. Then this is too big, right? Put a 0. This is just, uh, you can see. Okay, 11. Uh, this one can. Put 1. Okay, you get 3. This is too big. Now put a 2. 1. Okay, put a 1. And then after that, one can fit into one. Okay? So, yeah, it's a bit small, so I'll just like, zoom in. Over here. Okay? Alright, 
Alright, so yeah, so this this then the number starts from the one. Okay, so actually if your number like starts from zero, you don't really need that. But so you can just like start from the one and all the way to the end. So your number would be uh one zero one one zero one one. Okay? Good. Now you know how to do this already. Okay, next question. Alright, this is the next question. Um, explain how you would do like uh, okay so I'll just convert them to binary numbers right okay um so yeah now let's do it okay. for this you can just minus because all you need to do is just minus but if um, there's like a carry on or the bunny ear borrow, um, then, okay, if you have the bunny ear borrow, let's say this example, then this cancel this like, I mean, it's not for normal numbers, you will just put a 9, but for binary numbers, it's different, you put a 1 instead of um, other numbers, alright, so this is how you get it, alright, so let's move back to here. And so you just minus off like that, okay? This one minus is zero, this is one, zero, one. Alright, so this is your answer. Um this is your answer for a one minus eight. But to see whether it is correct, a one minus eight would be in three, am I right? Yeah, so we'll do eighty three in a uh, convert eighty three to binary numbers using the eight lines method. Okay, then you put your numbers. Okay, so now here's a Alright, so this is um, how you um, convert 83 to a binary number, so it will be like that. This is the number. Okay, so the number is actually this. Alright, so I'm just going to erase all of this. Alright, so um, if you see over here, it like uh, the number here and the number here is the same. That means my answer is correct. Alright, so this method you can use. It's just minusing, so it's quite simple. Alright, so I've come to the end because this is like the second question, which is the last question. So um. So um thank you for uh watching this video. Alright. Also I would like to thank this really cute little angry bird. Yeah, actually just met Nex. Uh you should know after watching this video. Uh like I use it to hold paper up on the board.
Yeah, so this angry rats are just manex lah. So a big thank you to all of you for watching this video. And also a big thank you to these angry birds for helping me hold up the pieces of paper in times of need, alright? So yeah. Thank you! So, uh, thank you!